it's amazing how that first inning can set the tone. I mean, he thought he looked pretty good coming out of the gate. Um, you know, gets to no two count and uh, hits a guy and, and then a, a walk. And next thing you know, he's got a 28 pitch first inning. Um, then, yeah, just uh, had a little trouble kind of finding his rhythm after that. And a 30 pitch third. And next thing you know, you've thrown 70 pitches and two and two thirds. Um, but look good early, but I think a couple of those those mistakes in, in the uh, in the first er- first inning kind of set a tone that he had trouble getting his his rhythm back. And uh, did, were you, I guess, maybe hopeful that in the second inning there that he had maybe found something to get a little bit back on the track? Yeah, it was a good clean inning in the second, and and then uh, a little bit of the same when we came came back into uh, the third. Um, you know, a couple of pitches they got more plate than what he wanted, but. Um, and, and we had a few walks today too that ended up hurting, but um, you know, just one of those days you could tell he was fighting a little bit and trying to amp up, and that wasn't working. And you know, then once you get that pitch count high I mean, in in that short amount of time, um, you know, it's it's hard to it's hard to get your body to cooperate and make fine pitches. Danny. Hey, Micah, with your offense this series, how, how much do you think it was a matter of um, running into three really good starters who, who kind of had really, who had really good games versus um, if you've seen another trend or anything with, with your offense? I got great stuff. That was, uh, that was an effortless 98 from the left side with a four-pitch mix once he started mixing the changeup late. Uh, you know, we saw the slider and, and the curveball, but you know, we, we've had some – uh, good games against good pitching. Uh, it's usually w- when we're fighting close games um, to give uh, that kind of stuff. You know, six run uh, head start makes it makes it kind of difficult. But um, you know, we, uh, we we believe in our offense against anybody. We're going to do the fight that we talked about, and we saw some of that even late. You know, a couple of times we were looking at putting the um, you know, winning or the time run in the hole, getting even just adding something to the lane. Real proud of the guys on the bench staying ready, coming in and each of them doing something to contribute offensively. But there was a lot of damage done and a lot of room to catch up by that point.